All right, let's take you outside to the San Diego County Fair. The Kings of Late Night taking the stage tonight. The ride's in full swing right now. A little hazy, a little dirty on our camera there, but it's near the coast. It's to be expected. All right, it's 83 degrees in Escondido right now. Ramona at 89, 88 in Warner Springs, 110 and 111 in the deserts, 74 in Oceanside, 71 degrees downtown. So talking about dew point temperatures, because yes, the humidity is going to be going up. In fact, some areas are already sticky. When you're looking at dew point temperature, that is the temperature that the actual temperature needs to drop to in order for dew to form. So this is the moisture content. Anything above 60 gets a little sticky. Mid 60s and higher is a little bit more uncomfortable and we're in the mid 60s in Fallbrook and in Vista. And that's just the beginning of it. Humidity is going to continue to go up due to tropical moisture to the south of us heading into this weekend. Tomorrow is going to be a hot one. A heat advisory for the inland and mountain areas begins at 10 a.m. 94 in Escondido, 93 in Ramona, El Cajon, a Julian in the low 90s as well as the Mount Laguna near 115 in Ocotillo Wells, Ramona, Alpine and and Santee also in the mid 90s. So limit your time outdoors, head to the beaches, any way you can keep cool. So this high pressure, that heat dome that we've been talking about for a while, it's finally starting to move westward. So it's replacing that cooler air that we've been under the influence of, but it's also pulling in moisture from the Gulf of Mexico, remnants from Tropical Storm Alberto. All of that is going to be shifting west as this high pressure system, the winds around it are steering that moisture. Right now impacting Arizona and New Mexico, we're gonna start to feel it over the weekend. So on Saturday, there's a very slim chance for pop-up shower or thunderstorm Saturday night. Slightly better chance on Sunday. This is at 1230 in the afternoon focused over the mountain and desert areas, but it's not impossible to see one move into the valleys, maybe even all the way to our coastline. Be cautious in the heat. Get your dogs out early in the morning or late at night. Take them for shorter walks because the air temperature when we're in the 80s and we're going to see 90s, the concrete and the asphalt can easily burn their paws. So even walking on the sand can be very hot for them. So walk in grassy surfaces or shaded areas and take them for shorter walks as well. Remember, never leave kids or pets in the back seat. Sunday, Monday, the warmest days along our coastline when we will see some 80s all the way to our beaches. Inland neighborhoods, Temperatures just as hot on Sunday. The heat advisory for the inland neighborhoods has been extended through Sunday, which I expected they were going to do. 80s return next week. The mountains, the heat advisory is only on Saturday because temperatures drop on Sunday as that moisture goes up. But we will see that slight chance for thunderstorms into Monday in the mountains, maybe even the deserts and the deserts. It's hot all the way through next week.